Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I didn't open this yet by the way, so I was ready to make this video. So, I got my address, sorry. Um, this is the Supersonic multi surface because you can, it works on jewelry, watches, um, dentures, partials. A couple of things, even toothbrushes, uh, tongue cleaners, all of the above. Anything that's like stainless steel, definitely custom jewelry. I wouldn't suggest to put this in here. But anything that's gold, silver, um, sterling silver, whatever's valuable, this is your guy. Okay, okay. Um, so we're gonna open this together. Hopefully you guys can hear me, and we're gonna see how this guy's going to work. Oh, by the way, look, guys, I also have. Uh, Mi denturas in cafecito. So I have my immediate dentures inside of some black coffee. This has been sitting in here since yesterday and I got caught up doing other motherly things and um, I forgot. So I didn't get to do my content yesterday, but just these are my immediate dentures sitting in the black coffee. And I always, I do black coffee because I only drink black coffee, by the way, for you, for you who don't know. Um, I normally drink it with a straw and I developed that habit when I had like my my um my biological teeth because of all the missing teeth that I had going on I don't know why I just suggested a straw works best and um, because these dentures are so pretty I don't want to ruin them with the black coffee but anyway, I left these sitting in there. We're gonna give it a try. We're gonna open this up. Uh, this is the pamphlet. Always look at your pamphlet. I mean, it's kind of sense, but I'm just saying, look at the pamphlet over the instructions and don't do nothing crazy, okay? Okay. So we're gonna open this up. By the way, this is still in the box and I've opened it. Huh? Oh, they broke it already. I didn't even use it. Okay. But you guys get to drift. Okay. Right over there. Hi, baby. This is the little guy. So we're going to have her here. Get these guys over there. Um, uh, get rid of that. I'm going to open this up. Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Watches. So you don't wet the battery of your watch but you can clean the jewelry of your watch by the way so just in case you guys were wondering like what the hell is this you just have your watch onto this your watch space will stay here and then the water will run over the jewelry um it's in a video actually when you're gonna per make your purchase it's like a little mini video but this is why i'm making your video okay okay but anyway um oh what i love about this is just like my other one but it's stainless steel, um, which is great. So for any time you're gonna use this, whether it's your jewelry, your dentures, for whatever you're gonna use it for, always make sure you clean this really thoroughly well before you're gonna add your water. And you already know. I'm going to untie this if I could. And then I'm going to um, add some water with my little Dr. B's solution. And we're gonna put this little guy to go work. Okay? Okay. Let's see how she's gonna work. So now she's on, by the way. We're gonna add some water. Water. Okay, just a little bit of water. I'll say about eh, that much. I hope you guys can see what I'm doing here. And then we're going to add, oh, by the way, look what I got here. My extra Dr. B's uh, gum and denture toothpaste that I left by. And if you don't believe me, um, hold on. These are my wasted ones, by the way, because I really love this stuff. I do not lie to you guys, right? I keep it 100 here. This is my experience. This is what's been helping me with my denture journey, keeping my mouth clean, keeping my gums healthy in the process of pressing prosthetics against them for 10 to 12 hours a day. 
the bomb. Okay? The bomb. But moving along. So Dr. B's Crystal Solution Polvorito, the powder one. I'm gonna add a little half. Nothing crazy. Just a little sobrecito. And then we're gonna add this in here. And not the whole thing, just a little half, okay? Hold on, because this is like really strong. And by the way, dentures are sitting in the coffee. They don't look bad, but they look ugh. Can you see that, guys? It looks really yellow. And I still have cushion grip on it, by the way. So we're gonna see right now. We're gonna put this to work. And here goes the other guy. Ew. She looks really dark. You see that? Maybe you can't pick it up on the camera, but. I mean, they're not bad. I didn't expect them to look dark and black. But anyway, let me start. Just what we're doing here. Hey. Just a little sprinkle, a little bit more. Hello? Okay, and I still have all this left, okay? So like I said, you don't need to use this whole entire portion. Don't do that. That's just a little bit of stuff there. The coffee's gonna go to the side. We're going to close her. We're going to turn her on. She might be loud. And now, she's in motion. And you can see, let me, I don't know if you guys can notice, but there's a little window here where you can see right through the side, inside, and there's an LED light as well. She's not as loud as I thought she would be. I don't know with the microphone, I might be picking it up a lot, but sorry. Um, we're gonna leave her on for about a good three minutes. Yeah, for about three minutes. And we're gonna sit and we're gonna chit chat while she's cleaning. Hopefully you guys are not picking up too much on the sound of this, but um, that's what she sounds like. So I figured we need a new denture bath because my other one is not working. And for those of you who may be like, well, just soak them in some water and call it a day. I don't want to. I want to take care of my dentures. You don't mind, right? Like I really love my dentures and um, insurance, coming out of pocket, whatever your journey has been, you want to take care of these teeth as much as you can. Even when you have a backup, you're like your immediates, like I do, I still have my immediates. I'm walking into just my permanents now. Um, this month I got, well, the month of January I got them, so I want to take care of them the best I can, okay? And you all should too, because you don't want to just let them get ruined, broken, of bacteria where you just can't use them anymore and you just can't it, your life is not going to function for what your purpose has been to get these bad teeth biological teeth out of your mouth to come into dentures to just let them just because they're not your biological teeth i mean they belong to you now so they are yours like let's be realistic here you know it's something that we have to put in our mouth so i want to have like the best care that i can to keep them as polished and new as i could so um you know, these are acrylic material. This is not zirconias and um, like implant material. You know, these are a lot more, life will hit it harder than what it would with some zirconias and implants if you get my drip. So let's just, you know, enjoy the oral hygiene, learn about it, get educated so that we can really make use of what we have to go through with dealing with dentures. I hope this all makes sense to you guys because um, we need to do that. So I'm gonna give it, oh, time's up. There's are three minutes right there. Let's look at them now, let's see. Maybe I'm gonna get closer to the camera. Give me a second, okay? Hold on, one second though. Oh, and we're gonna see if the cushion grip came off. Let's see that. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Oh, they look so nice. They look good. They look good. They look very good. They look very good. They look very good. No more cushion grip. No more stain from the coffee. Okay. They look pretty good. Not bad. Not bad. See the bottoms? 
I'll put this to the side right here. These are my bottoms. Oh, and I also had questions regarding um, but they look much better than when they came out from like before. They had all the dark coffee like in between the little crevices and yeah, it was looking gross. This is why I drink my black coffee with a straw, guys, because I just don't want to bore my teeth. I most of the time would have coffee before I even pop them in my mouth, but I'm a heavy coffee drinker, like I told you guys before. So um, I like to drink my coffee with a straw. But anyway, besides that point, um, these, do you see how low they are right here? You can see there's like barely a wall. That was kind of my fault. I did a lot of adjustments when I had these guys because I just felt like I had so much going on without realizing how much more my mouth was going to shrink. So the less wall of your trough, of your dentures, the less they're gonna stay in. The deeper, like when I used to make my cushion grip with that little pocket that I used to enjoy making in the bottom, like that would really give me a little bit more grip with these things that are so huge in my mouth because these are my immediates, by the way. So um, they look clean, they came out really good. I love it. And um, yeah. They look pretty good, pretty good. Another thing was that, yeah, guys, if you want to make your own adjustments, you do so, but do not remove too much of the wall because that's going to be a huge mistake moving down your journey as you are shrinking and shrinking and shrinking. I am almost 15 months post op, so I've shrunk a lot, and I know I'm going to continue to shrink. I mean, we're in dentures, let's be realistic, you know, but um, again, don't take off too much. Just take off enough where you can be, where well, it's not stabbing you in your front of them, um, but enough to give you that grip to just keep them down because the less of that wall, the less they're gonna stay in. Guarantee you that, I promise. So this machine works really good. You can see a little bit of the residue from the, um, from the cushion grip. I don't know if you can see it now, but and the water looks a little cloudy. They could do a good job. I like it. Really good. What I will do is, in another video, I'll get like some old, real gold jewelry that I have. One of them has like some little bit of diamonds on it. I haven't worn that chain. Oof, it's been so long. Um, but she really needs to get like professionally clean and this does the job. So let's give it a try if you guys like it. I really like it, it's cute. Um, I mean, I don't have a huge bathroom space, but I'll keep this probably in my room because knowing my son, he might just be like, turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off. So um, I hope this video helps. And um, yeah, so I will see you guys in the next video, hopefully soon. And that'll be all. Bye.